Amber, Amber, Amber. It seems like the internet think that she's only good for lighting up torches around the map. And as soon as the game came out, there was some tier list that came out saying that she's a F tier character. She's not good for anything. Listen, I'm not here today to tell you that she's actually a triple S tier character. That she's godlike. But I think I found a way to make her pretty viable. Pretty, pretty fucking good. I think we have a, a B or A tier type of character right here. If used properly. If used properly. I feel like every character in the game should be viable. Obviously, 5 star character will most likely always be better than 4 star character. But how should I know? I didn't have a 5 star character for the longest time. Not gonna lie, I literally got kicking this morning. And boy will I love this character with all my art. I, I finally fucking got a 5 star character. Took a while, but we, we finally got it. And boy will she be the love of my life. You have no fucking idea how much time it fucking took me for finally getting a 5 star character. It's insane. I don't even understand... I was fucking possible for me not to get a single fucking 5 character for the longest time. Anyway, back to the topic of this video before I lose all of my sanity. Amber, I think I got a good Wombo Combo here. And the Wombo Combo here that I think is uh, pretty good is her and Xiang Ling. Honestly, Xiang Ling is pretty good with everyone. The fact that her Q still on the field for the longest time, her, her little bear that she has. It's just amazing. She's such an amazing support. However, I think she's especially good with Amber for a couple of reasons. So first, when you look at her constellation, she really helps any other power character by reducing power resistance. Her first constellation actually reduced power resistance for 6 seconds on it when uh, her little bear hit anything. And you will see Amber is a fire character. So that's... That's, that's a match! We got something here. So obviously that's uh, that's pretty good. Um, Amber doesn't do a lot of like fire damage with her, her regular shot. But her little plushy does fire damage. And also her Q does fire damage. So we got a good Wombo combo. On top of that, having two fire characters in the same team give you elemental resonance. And that my friend just give you straight up damage for fire character. But really, the core of this combo comes in when you look at the E of both of those characters. It's basically the E of Zhangling give her a little bear that will spit fire in AoE in front of the bear. And that's really cool because the E of Ember give her a little puppet which attract enemy. So, in theory, if you have the puppet of Ember in one area, the puppet is gonna attract enemy in one, in one single area. And after that, you got Quobo. Quoba or whatever the fuck it's called that's gonna spit fire on all of those enemy. So that's that's the Wombo combo we're trying to do today. The problem today is that Maxanla is not at max uh, potential. She could be so much better than that. She doesn't have a lot of attack. She does have 1,100, which is not that bad. But compared to the two DPS that I've got, uh, which is Amber at 1,500. And actually, Lisa at 1,400. That's a little bit better. So definitely, and that's my tank, Noel. Uh, she only has uh, 1,100, but she's not really my DPS in my team. So really, Zanling could be better, and that's a work in progress. But even without the full potential of this team, I think we can still have something good. Because again, I don't have like a lot of, I don't have any constellation for uh, both of those characters. And obviously that could help, but I think even without that, we can have a good Wombo combo on it on our end today. And on one team, we'll have Ember, Noel, Xiang uh, Ling, and the main character. The reason why I put Noel is that I just need a little bit of sustainability. I still need Barbara for my second team because uh, I Wombo combo with Lisa, and that's really fucking good. Uh, I only need really a tree character. Uh, those are kind of the tree, and I don't really need fish because I don't have anything on fish. Uh, I could put any other electro. The thing is that I just want resonance uh, with Lisa to give her a little advantage, and uh, and that's pretty much it. By the way, my first team went Amber and Xiang Ling. I call this combo the plushy plushy team. The reason why is that Amber has a puppet with 
which is kind of just a plushie. And Xenling, even though she got a little bear, which is an actual bear, uh, it, it, it kind of just looked like a plushie too. So I call it a plushie plushie team, and we'll see how the plushie plushie team can handle the, the eat. Alright, let's see what we got. Increase damage, dealt to weak point. Defense and defense. Well, that's dog shit. So, I'm just gonna go with that. Hopefully, I can do a decent amount of damage. Um, in a decent amount of time. But, uh, yeah, in general, when I, I get straight up damage, it does help a little bit. Ah! What am I doing? What am I doing? Probably pop my Q with uh, Noel quite often. That's gonna help a lot. I know this team is supposed to be centered around Xiangling and Ember, but if I have my Q with Noel, I'm definitely gonna use it. So, it's kind of sad because right now, and we are not really all at the same spot. But you can see that uh, my little puppet does a decent amount of damage. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's some good damage right there. That's some good damage. Yeah, it's it's really more effective when uh, there's a lot of the enemy like next to each other, and uh, right now it doesn't really shine because <laughs> they're all like a different location. But I know this team is uh it's pretty good. I believe in it. Nope, nope, no, nope. wrong character. Soon my Q. That's very good. Oh, hold on. Q ear too. There you go. It's, it's kind of having a little squad of like, helper around you. You're just making sure that uh, all the damage is getting in. See? It's just like, some sweet help around the place. I'm just gonna put- uh, I totally missed that. Q, it's fine, it's fine though. Everything is okay. I just uh, need to make sure that uh... Oh. Just need to make sure that I'm healing once in a while with Noel, with her shield up in general, it helps a lot. Okay, and. Should be fine at this point. Pop that just for funsy. Ah, I'm almost done. And we'll have uh, a two minute of pure fun. Ah, uh, no. Maybe not two minute of uh, advance, but uh, should be soon done. 130? No. One. I'd at least one minute um, above what I'm supposed to be. There you go. One, 110, 120. Because I, I need another five minutes at the very least for the, for the second team. Which we'll skip. We'll skip the second team. Because this is not the focus of uh, the this video today. But Lisa Barbara combo. It's pretty good too. Alright, donezo! We have 2 minute and 2 minute 35 on the counter left. And uh, look at that beautiful 3 star for Abyss 6, the first floor. 
So now let's see how good our little team is against the boss. Maybe we won't be able to have some speed run world record time, but we, we should be able to down this boss in a fairly easy manner. So I took the fire one so we can see what the, the raw damage is without any wumble combo with the elemental advantage. And uh, let's see, I, I decided to have Barbara tag along. It's just so that we can down the boss as uh, fast as uh, possible. And uh, yeah, let's see. The goal is really to just down the bus and then Wumble combo the fuck out of it. Uh okay, I need to continue with the Oh my god. <laughs> I like for half a second. Okay. A, a turn of the uh, the life of the boss right away. It, it's not that bad. It's it's pretty decent. Let's see if uh, we can down him again quite fast. Barra just uh, murdering that boss in general. Regardless of your team, not gonna lie. I don't know why it took me some time before I start. Basic attacking. I just lagged mentally for half second. See, pretty good damage. Pretty fucking good damage. Barbara is so fucking good against that boss in general. Not gonna lie. This might be uh, a, bar a Barbara focused video now just because fuck that I love this character. She heals so fucking much. It's insane. I'm just basic attacking for funsy. I'm just waiting so I can uh, have my turn to down the, down the boss again. Again, not we're not going for this the world record for this boss, but we should be able to down him one last time, and then that should be it. Oh my God, nope, maybe not, because uh, again, my brain just doesn't work. <laughs> oh my god, that's uh, that's solely on me. That's solely on me. I, I probably would have been able to like finish him on this one. I can probably go with Xiang Lang. Q for funsy. Keep in the range. There we go. Poke the, the little plushie. Ah, then that's it! That's it, we got it! Okay, so it wasn't that extremely uh, intense. I know some people might be in the comment being like, Well, I can solo with Diluc in like 4 seconds. I'm like, listen, I understand there's better Wumble Combo and there's better character. My goal today, it was just to show you some way that uh, Ember can be viable. It's, it's only what I'm looking for. If people can stop trashing Ember so fucking badly on the internet, that'll be a fucking victory for me. Not only that, not only that uh, she got a decent Wumble combo, but she's also the gliding champion of Mondstadt. That's uh, that's another plus. And on top of that, on on top of all of that, not gonna lie, uh, she's she's also as her advantage, not gonna lie, there's a pretty good advantage uh, for this character um, compared to other character where you don't you don't have enough uh, you don't have uh, as much advantage. Look at that! Look at that! Look at that! Amber having pretty pretty good pretty good reason why you should play her. And that's pretty much it for this video today. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment, subscribe, do all that good shit. Not gonna lie, it's gonna help me a little bit compete with the people that put uh, five hundred thousand dollar in this game. But I'm just gonna rant about that for half a second before we go. The people are just like putting some video out there, being like, "I put my life saving into this game, so you don't have to." That's a lie. That's such a fucking lie. There's like ten thousand video of them. 
You just put all of your money into this game because you wanted to. Don't act like you're the fucking messiah being like, I sacrifice myself so that all of you can live a better life. No, no, you fucking put money into this game because you wanted to and don't fucking lie about it. Anyway, Red Silver, thank you for watching. Peace.